How's it going everybody, Doi here with another Dragon Ball Fighters video. In this video we're going to be talking a little bit more about Merge Zamasu, a character coming to Dragon Ball Fighters in the very near future, and we're going to be covering everything we know about the character so far, and the information that we have coming very soon, but we'll cover that near the end of the video. For now, let's start by going over these newly released HD photos for the character. Up first, we have these three pictures, which I believe all three of them are related to his level three. Uh, don't get me wrong, this first one could be his cinematic intro, but I don't really buy into that due to the little bit of energy we see right here. As you can see right here, it does look like the same color as the energy seen in this photo. And then in this third photo, we have what the move will probably look like after the initial cinematic, uh, just crashing down on Trunks holding him uh, in that particular spot. Not sure if the move is an actual cinematic single target hit or if it picks the opponent up a little bit, as you can see Trunks is lifted off the ground here. So that may be something to look into when Merge Zamasu eventually comes out. For those of you that haven't watched Dragon Ball Super or you're either watching the English dub and haven't caught up to this point yet, this is what Lightning of Absolution looks like in this show. As you can see they did recreate it pretty well, but I feel like with Dragon Ball Fighters at this point that that's kind of a given. So yes, my personal opinion that this is going to be his level 3, it's of proper scaling and it looks awesome enough to be a level 3 cinematic for this game, uh, but let me know your opinions in the comments down below. As for his other supers, we do have the Holy Light Grenade, which is probably going to be his level 1. Here's a picture of the first part of the attack, and a picture of the second part of the attack. Now the only thing that makes me think that Lightning of Absolution isn't a level 3, is just how good this Holy Light Grenade technique looks. I mean, this second picture looks extremely cinematic, so I'd be surprised if they didn't incorporate maybe like a 2 bar spending program or something, or maybe you can charge it up with a certain amount of bar. There's really no reason for me to think that, it's just that the move looks very cinematic for what I would say is a level 1. Up next in terms of supers, or maybe even a special attack, we have Zamasu's Blades of Judgment. Uh, all we have for that is just this one picture here, but it looks super cool in this photo, and I really like the lighting effects they gave it, and the stance Zamasu is in. Uh, probably going to be a super, but again, I wouldn't be surprised if this is just a special attack, as Zamasu is listed as having double S range. So Zamasu could be the first zoner in this game, if, of course, his projectiles stop super dashing. Uh, so that's something to consider. And after that, we have probably the biggest picture for me, because we can see what Zamasu's in-game 8-way movement system looks like. So Zamasu's the only character who can enter this float-like stance, and once he's in this stance, he can go all eight directions. Uh, for people newer to fighting games, this is basically, uh, it makes the character extremely fast. They can become an extremely efficient zoner, and it can also lead to characters with eight-way dashes having extremely technical combos. So all of that's very good reason to be excited for this stance. Hopefully they make it very good, they make it fast enough to be usable. And then for our final picture, we just have Zamasu doing an overhead kick. Uh, doesn't look like anything too special. Uh, no reason to assume that this is anything more than just an air normal. But at the very least, it is good to know that he's going to be playing by the in-game systems already so we don't have to learn too much and with that last picture out of the way that was all of the new pictures we have gotten so far but that's not the end of the merge zamasu news because it's been confirmed that we will be receiving a zamasu trailer on the 25th of this month so that is tomorrow if you're watching this on youtube and and two days from now if you're watching this on patreon and really that's insane we could be looking at some gameplay of zamasu we could be getting an actual full-fledged trailer uh, i don't think any of that's confirmed yet but at the very least we're going to be receiving a lot of new news on zamasu so make sure you subscribe to the channel if you want to stay updated on that. Make sure you let me know down in the comments what your thoughts on all of these pictures for Zamasu are, are you hyped about receiving more news for him on the 25th like I am, and you know what, make sure to let me know who your favorite Dragon Ball Super character is because for me it's absolutely few Zamasu. While you're down there, if you enjoy this channel and like the video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. I'm Dato Doya, and I'll see you in the next video.